Lexus trademarks the RZ450E nameplate in USA and Europe. Lexus has registered the RZ450E in the USA, Europe, and Australia over the past two weeks. Suggesting both a new model and a new powertrain could be on the way. Of course, there is the matter of figuring out what exactly the RZ450E nameplate could be. Considering the current market, it's a safe assumption this new model will be a crossover of some description. The engine is an even safer bet, as Lexus has adopted the letter E as their battery electric designation. Key to this puzzle is the Z, as it essentially guarantees a new model. The R is also interesting, because the two other Lexus vehicles to share the letter are a crossover and a coupe, a combination that's more and more common among luxury manufacturers. Toyota announced that it would release six battery electric vehicles by 2025, with the first to debut in 2020. The UX300e kicked things off, launching in China earlier this year, and it's clear another Lexus EV is on the horizon. The 2023 Lexus RZ electric SUV will make its debut in the first half of next year, the company has announced. The RZ is the first pure electric model from Lexus, underpinned by the same ETNGA platform as the recently unveiled Toyota BZ4X and Subaru Solterra. Though the exact model name has yet to be confirmed, the car maker has trademarked the RZ450E badge in Australia. While full details of the new Lexus will be revealed at its unveiling, it's expected the model could adopt the 90 kWh battery pack previewed in the LFZ concept earlier this year, R, likely powering dual 150 kW electric motors for a combined output of 300 kW. A claimed driving range of between 500 and 600 kilometers on a single charge is expected, although real-world figures will likely be lower. The RZ closely resembles the LFZ concept, adapting the company's design language to help differentiate the model from its Toyota counterpart. A gloss black C-pillar creates the illusion of wrap around rear glass, while the black plastic cladding around the wheel arches appears to be a design feature shared with the Toyota.